Aloha, me! Hello, hello, everybody! So, 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 so... I... I look so silly. So sorry for the wait! I was just making some tea. <laughs> I was just making some tea. For my goat. Do you like my hair? I got the Bob Ross too. I got the... I got the... I got the... I got the buckle. I got the hidden buckle, crouching buckle, hidden buckle, you know. Uh... This is kind of like... As good as it's gonna be able to work to stick on my head. Yeah, it's, it's all the humidity and stuff today, you know? It's like... It's like way too moist outside. So, uh, of course... Uh, when the weather gets like that... When the weather gets like that, my hair gets all... Crazy. Actually, um, I do have naturally, like... Kind of wavy, a little bit fuzzy hair, but it's not like, uh... Not to this extent. Not to this extent at all. Uh... But... But... Yeah, obviously, I don't actually... That'd be kind of cool, though. I, I feel like it would be kind of cute, you know? Do I look cute right now? <laughs> and why do I keep freezing? Stupid, 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 stupid... Let me disconnect and connect again... To me, Bridger! Okay, hopefully that solves it. Uh, anyway, oh Hamia, this is your dream even spider mama, Amia Aranya. Um, it's Thursday. Welcome to Thursday. I'm very excited because tomorrow I get to go to Popeyes. I'm gonna have Popeyes tomorrow. <laughs> um Oh, you think it looks like bubbles, like bath bath bubbles? The hair buckles install the humidifier. How dare you? <laughs> um uh, why would you do that? You must really like this hairstyle to do that, huh? Sorry, I'm I'm like uh, juggling a little bit. Uh, I I was juggling a little bit with uh, uh, getting getting stuff set up for the stream. It's a little bit complicated. The way it's gonna work, I I do have. Hopefully, it's not a problem. I do have the Bob Ross video playing really, really, really tiny in the corner, and we're gonna hear him talk. But then. I'm gonna have my BGM, so... You know, hopefully it's not... Hopefully... I, I don't think it'll be a problem. I don't think so. But, uh... I, 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 I will deal with it if it becomes a problem, but... Uh, yeah, I am gonna try showing it on the screen, but it's gonna be really, really small. Yeah, just don't tell on me, okay, you guys? <laughs> Um, 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 uh, my day's been good. I have been very, like, uh, trying to get work done and then just keep getting distracted by various things. My brain is all over the place today. It's all over the place, but, uh, see people do this on Twitch before without any issues. Who knows with YouTube? Oh, well, yeah, Twitch is a whole different beast than YouTube. There's no guarantee that it's going to, uh, be fine, but I think with the precautions that I've taken, it should be fine. I think usually those things get identified by like audio, and since I'm gonna have my BGM on it, be Bridger, please, please. Give me one second to try and fix this. I don't know why it keeps disconnecting. Don't eat my hair. It is not cotton candy. I know it looks a lot like cotton candy and it tastes a lot like cotton candy, but it will not dissolve in your mouth. And you will in fact have a... Uh, 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 have you ever seen like My Strange Addiction or whatever where they eat hair? That's what your guys' bellies are gonna be like. You're gonna have a giant ummy hairball in your belly and it's not gonna be good and you're gonna have to go to the hospital. It's not eternal co It's not infinite! Stop! Why is that your first reaction? <laughs> what the frick? Um... Uh, what about today's stream also? So, check the pin message if you guys want to paint along with me. You can probably use any other, uh... <sighs> I guess I'm just gonna have to deal with freezing today, huh? You can probably use any other, like, um... Art software, really. Uh, but I'm using Clip Studio Paint. I'm using a specific set that comes with Clip Studio Paint. Which, did I get it? Did I... Okay, I downloaded it. Okay, I got it, I got it, I got it. Um... What if you eat your vegetables? You still can't eat my hair. I need hair. <laughs> I need hair on my head to be cute. To be, to be me, to be ummy. Um... 
It's got me, uh, 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 the stream's got me on the shortest. I gotta try and keep it to like two hours because I do have another stream later today that I still have to prepare a little bit for, which I'm very extremely, supremely nervous about because I'm just nervous that I'm gonna be cringe. <laughs> I mean, I am gonna be cringe, but I'm gonna be... I'm nervous that it's gonna be, like, too cringy and all. <sighs> My tea is still too hot. Okay. So, yeah. We're gonna... We're gonna... We're gonna... You know, keep it a little bit on the shorter side. But that's fine, because, you know, I think we can get two... or so paintings done. If we do that... Sniffing my hair is okay, just don't eat it. Yeah, oh how about bras? <laughs> um, let me say hi to everyone and then we can get started. Um oh, I burnt my tongue. Uh hello to uh Seek and Gildrian and ZR and Flash Tirade and Necrozma and Koala Slime and Turbo and Messi and Star Pop and Gento and Heart and Bansu and Kogi and Pudstorm and Mama Ma and Kayla and Aetian. Hello to Shrike and FC and Marv and Luminous Wings and Hinge and Mangu and Hero. Hello Gold Heart Dragon. I seriously I'm so irritated by it. <laughs> I'm so irritated by V-Bridger today. Um, hello, Sumptuous Potato, and Doi Roll, and Railgun, Only Mirega Cash, who did he, Masuka? Hello, Peppermint, and Sturm, and Fugging Ton. Hello to K7, and Koshi, and Zavalisk, and James Blue Flames. Hello, Akatsuki. Hello, uh, AX, and Temporal Paradox, and Mega Blender, and Kappas, and uh, hello, Dragoof. And Big Sif, and Golden Slaughter, and Ohamia to Iron Stag, and Nugget, and Finite Set. Hello to Indecisive, and Fish, and Kyoko, and Big Guy, and Reverie, and Wave File, and Phoenix, and Talon, and Dylan. Hello to Pyrie, and Red Rodin, and Chester, and. Uh, how do I say this? Oh god. Liuxe? Liuxe? Uh, L I E U X E. I have no idea how to say that. I'm so sorry. Uh, hi, Penny Burger and Maxter and Eat Watch Play and Yonju Nana. Hello to Miller and. Oh, why is my phone vibrating? Hello, uh, Lazim and Uncle Red and Riding Soul and Mr. Front. Hello, Liquid Cat and Mimi and Esprise. Hello, Apaka. Hello, Jeweler and Eki and Iskander and Razzle Dazzle and Movic and Mr. Potato and Eki50. Uh, God, there's so much noise outside right now. Uh, hello, Cyrus and uh, Vogon and Comfy Noise and Darth Azimer and Bendy Neckle and Human Fly. <laughs> Excuse me, hiccup, hiccup. Um, I've had errant hiccups randomly today. Hello, Masa. Hello, Rabbit Bunny Man and Obi and Silver Mick. And hello to Tsukimi and Blau and Ohamiya to Tink Heck and um uh hello Brum and Neo Blackguard and Poncho and Passion Bot and hello Rosa Kanan and No Fun Zone and Bike and Bubon Hello Huxay and uh yeah. Hello Smoker Mega Drive Hello Bippa and Incisor and Ado Boy and uh 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 P Taco Hello to Jason and Oh hello lurkers and vlog watchers as well and hello to Deku Fire Mage and Justin and uh, Pink Dragon and Pit Master Jake and Roqueto Kato and Shubi and Tasty Snacks Ooh a tasty snack for me Hello Jean de Game I do look like a happy little cloud, don't I? Hello, Deathwind, and hello, Trust, and thank you for the 17 months! Wow! Wow, that's a long time, thank you so much! I totally didn't forget about this! Oh, have me, oh, have me to you as well! Uh, he he hello, D uh, GN, hello, DJ, and Sweet Woo Bull, and Handsome Orc! Uh, and that is everybody! Hello, you guys, I'm going to... Um, restart V Bridger. Really quickly, because it is not behaving as it's supposed to. It keeps freezing. 
which is supremely annoying. Uh, so just give me one second to do that, and then we'll get right into the painting. Boop, beep, boop, beep, boop, boop, beep, boop. Is my tea cool enough yet? Hold on. It's still hot. Yeah, I don't know what why I've been having so much problems with V Bridger lately. Some days it's totally fine. There's like zero problems, and then some days it just doesn't stop. Uh, freezing. It's very strange. <laughs> I think that should be fine. Yeah, we're good, we're good. Um, um, dip, 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 um, um, the tea I'm drinking today is the same kind I had yesterday. It's throat coat. To, to help with my throat a little bit. I irritated my throat earlier this week. Uh, inhaling from inhaling water in the shower. So be very careful to not do that, you guys. And then, and then, um, also, I was gonna tweet about this, but then I forgot. Cause like I said, my mind's been all over the place today, but I had, uh... I knocked... Uh... My deodorant... In the toilet yesterday. I threw it out, don't worry, I threw it out. I'm not like gonna use it after... Uh, like... Like I'm not gonna... <laughs> I'm not gonna do anything with it. And, and I have more deodorant, let me just say that. Cause I get the big packs from... From, uh... From Costco. <laughs> I got the big packs from Costco, so uh, it's fine. I have I have more. Uh, no, I already I already took it out. I already took it out <laughs> and threw it out. So don't just rinse it. No, are you crazy? Disgusting. Yeah, I still have deodorant. I'm not gonna be stinky or anything, but just an anecdote. I don't know. I just thought it was funny, but then the story doesn't really go anywhere, does it? I have a problem with telling anecdotes a lot. Intentional or accidental? Why would I intentionally knock my deodorant in the toilet? <laughs> I have to like reach in the toilet. Is yeah, it's disgusting. Disgusting. <laughs> uh, it, of course it was. It was an accident. I knocked a little shelf that like my toiletries are on, and yeah, it fell. It fell. Very sad. Oh, you want to try being a stink pig? I didn't. I didn't. Uh, yeah, it's because I'm a spider cat, but it wasn't, it was not intentional though. You know, cats, they don't always intentionally knock stuff over. Sometimes it's not on purpose, you know. Toilet probably cleaner than most phones. Um, I don't know where you're getting that from, but I don't, I don't think so. At least not my toilet and my phone. I don't think, I don't know. Toiletries, no, like toiletries, like, uh, you know, like, uh, deodorant and stuff. Is that a toiletry? I don't know. Yeah, sometimes it's not their fault. Sometimes they're acquitted in a court of law, and sometimes they're, they're scammed. Uh, and they are found guilty even though they were not. Mine don't ever push stuff or knock stuff over, must be a personality thing. To be honest, um, mine don't really either, at least, like, not out of spite or anything. Hi, Archangel. I, I'm mostly like just trying to, to, to play, you know. Do I use deodorant on the toilet? I mean... Not typically. I mean, I'm sure there's one point in my life where I was on the toilet and then just, just decided to multitask and put deodorant on at the same time. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe really, really in a rush for work in the morning, you know, to get to work. Mine just yell at me when I don't cater to them for a few seconds. Oh, mine do that. Or what? Mine does that. Um, okay. Let's get right into painting, shall we? ba 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 Kato here sometimes swipes stuff by accident or... By accident with the tail or when she climbs around. Yeah, yeah. Sometimes it, it actually is an accident. We can't blame the kitties for everything. Okay, so here is my CSP. You guys can't see my uh, color mixing thing, but it is here. Uh, because I guess it doesn't capture these like mod modal window thingies. Um, and what size do I want the canvas? I think this is too big. I think I'm gonna make a new 
fan base, I think it will be. Hmm, what's a good size? I don't know. 800 by 600, maybe? Uh, hi, Zircon! So maybe something like that? Is that like a canvas? I don't know. I might have to end up rotating it, too. Oh my god, someone's mowing outside. Um, hello, Vector Man! Um, I'm using my other chat application to talk to you guys today, by the way, so... Uh, if there's any funkiness, blame it on that. 18 by 24. Okay, let me, let me... Uh... Can I set it the resolution in that way, or I can do like... I'm gonna run the colors across on the bottom of the screen stream so that we can use the same colors as you, as you while following along. You'll just have to, uh, you know... You'll just have to... What's the word I'm looking for? Watch the Bob Ross video yourself. If, if it's not enough to have it in the corner, because I will have it in the corner. Uh... Definitely, you guys definitely should have figured this out beforehand. Uh, apologies. <laughs> I just, for some reason, I didn't think that... I guess I was just kind of thinking that, uh, you know... CSP would do it for me, you know? I don't know why I thought that, but... <laughs> um... Let's do... Uh... A4. I don't know, it doesn't have to be exact, to be honest. Okay! CSP should have a shortcut that does nothing except make the brush cleaning noise. Pata 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 pata. You don't think Bob Ross colors are available on pa on paint programs? I think, uh... I mean, they're, they're specifically available on the paint program I use because I downloaded them. But yeah, otherwise you'll just have to... Uh, do your best approximation with the color picker. Alright, and then my set. I have these Happy Colors... Joy of Doodling Pack. So I'm gonna add that to my color set here. All right. Hi, good daddy. It's Masha. It's hello, hello. And then... The brushes. So there is a, um... What's it called? There is a wide bristled brush. There is a tap and fan brush. There's a palette knife. There is a dry brush, which just moves the paint around. And then there is a detail brush. So I'm going to bring those all over to... Into my brushes. Hello, Jamal. Just waiting for that to load. Bum, ba, dum, ba. Okay, there we go. So we got the wide bristles, taps and fan, palette knife, dry brush, and detail brush. And the first thing I have to do is fill my canvas with white because titanium white <laughs> because how this works is it like it like does some color mixing for you if you're using clip studio paint 2.0 but you have to have white on or you know some color all over it doesn't have to be white i don't think bob ross is um like uh bob ross is Canvases all start in white. Sometimes he does black, right? Uh, hi Helios! Don't forget to smack the brush. I wish I had an actual physical brush to, 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 to beat the devil out of. Sadly, I cannot. Um... Hi, uh, I am Titanium. Hello, Fiero! Dry brush is ironically kind of like the liquify brush. Kind of, but it's like te really textured. Yeah, kind of, kind of. Okay, I'm nervous. You guys let me know if you can see this video, okay? Very simple. Uh, thank you. I don't know. Do you guys need to Let's hear it? I have the subtitles, the so maybe that's fine. While they're doing that, I'm sure you're gonna get up here today. You see it? Okay, perfect. Oh wait, maybe you guys can't see the subtitles. Oh, there it is. Very thin coat of liquid white. That's basically all. We use 18 by 24 inch canvas, but you use any size that you like when you're doing your. Mom, mom, ba. There's Bob. Little, There's a boy. Just a little two inch brush today. I'm gonna tap a little bit of Indian yellow into it. Is this okay? Is this okay? I mean, I can turn the audio off if, if, uh, you know. Right here, we'll do that. That's all there is to if it gets distracting hearing his talking. Okay. That one finished. Is that easy? 
We'll go into a little bit of cat yellow. Turn down BGM? Sure, sure. Do anything, just go around the edges. You don't think it'll be a problem? Okay, we'll keep it like this and you know, you know if you guys uh notice any issues, just just let me know, okay? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna start over because this man is very difficult to catch up with. <laughs> Hi Josh Hartman. Hi, welcome back. Certainly glad you Hi, welcome back. I, I might have to end up going back to in the in the thing. Let's start out and have run all the colors across the screen that you'll need to paint. Run all the colors across the screen. Let me show you what I got up here today. I have my plain old 18 by 24 inch wow. pre-stretch canvas and I've just covered it. He's got pre-stretch canvas. Coat of liquid white. It's good fight. We use 18 by 24 inch canvas, but you use any size that you like. I could slow down the video playback, yeah. We'll see if I need little, to. Just a little two inch brush today. I'm going to tap a little bit of Indian yellow into it. Indian yellow. Maybe oh, here, I do have that. Okay. Something about like so. Let's go up in here. And maybe right here. We'll do and then that. we're doing... We're doing like uh okay I'm gonna I'm gonna lessen the amount of paint. Easy. What do you mean finish? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Same way. Just use a little two inch brush. A little bit of cad yellow, cadmium yellow. Oh my god, it's so fast. And then go around the edges. I'm gonna lessen the amount of paint again. There. Just working the yellow. Wait, yellow ochre! Slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Something about like that. Put two eyes on Yellow ochre. Yo, ochre. Okay. That's this one. Okay, yeah, let's actually slow down the playback of the video. Hold on. <laughs> it's way too fast! Dude! Let's do 0.75, maybe that'll be fine. Do anything, just go okay. around the edges. Without cleaning it, touch a little bit of yellow ochre. Yellow ochre. Without cleaning your brush, well, I don't, I don't have that problem. Just working the yellows out here. It's working the yellows out. Chill, Bob. Something about it's not common if you gotta follow the broadcast while it's on TV. And a big face Don't do that. <laughs> like little so he's making it so that it's like a halo. It's like a halo around it. Okay. Those together. What happens if I change the color stretch? And that's all we're looking for today. Something about like, yeah. Okay. Without cleaning the brush, go touch a little bit of the lizard crimson. Lizard and crimson. Lizard crimson. What is that? What is that? Lizard crimson. Just begin. That's light red. Lizard crimson. Lizard. I want to make a. I want to make. Uh, and he kind of mixes that in with the previous color, so I'm gonna try and do that on my mixing thingy here. Full day. We'll do the uh, painting mostly in brown tones. Bob. Sometimes it's gorgeous to do paintings. <laughs> so is it crimson? There we are. Oh, and then he goes even darker on the other side, or even brighter, I should say. Right. More yeah, pinker. I like brown. Okay, so far mine's looking very, very brush strokey. And the lizard crimson. That's one of my favorite colors. There's another set you can put on the blend stuff more, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm not messing I'm with that. Mix He's mixing what? Brush. Lizard crimson and just a small amount. And what was it? Sap green. Oh, we don't worry about mixing color too well. This is like so yeah. stressful. I can't even look at chat. <laughs> I gotta go back. I gotta go back. <laughs> He's doing round strokes around it while you're brushing yeah. outward. Yeah, it's hard to duplicate it. You know, the brushes are not like one to one. Made from it's sap very green. tough. And the lizard. Sap green and lizard crimson. Okay. I'm gonna mix it a little bit to the reddish side. A little bit to the reddish side. His is really, really dark, so I'm gonna add black, really even though when you're painting, you shouldn't really usually add Today, black. <laughs> I think. Green streaks up in the sky. Okay. It's a bit bright. Wipe the old knife. Okay. He's using a palette knife. No, he's using the the white bristle one again. That's way that. too big. Okay, uh. It sort of matches all this. It sort of works together. It's really a gorgeous brown. I mean, Tashi and Murphy. It's a gorgeous brown. Gorgeous. So, so go gorgeous. Gorgeous. Just right in there. 
finish the canvas up. But wow, mine looks nothing like his. <laughs> finish the canvas off. Mine's so much smaller. Oh god. Here, let's do. Let's do. Uh, okay, I chat. Ready to wash the old brush. <laughs> No, it's hot. Okay. Let's make my brush bigger. There are no mistakes, they're just happy accidents. Oh, there's mistakes. Oh, there's mistakes, alright. Okay, Van Dyke Brown, that is this really dark one. Oh, that's Midnight Black. What's Van Dyke Brown? This one. I suggest when you do this at home, you get a little device called a brush beater rack. A brush beater rack? I don't have that. Waste paper basket. Is this like the sun? It's supposed to be the sun, yes. I'm gonna blend things. I'm gonna make it so that there's like no paint on the brush and then I'm going to uh, just do a little blendy blend. Like this. Ah, now that's the stuff. That's gonna look more like his. He does paint fast. He's a professional. He's a professional. I'm really just looking for excuses to wash the brush. Yeah, because you like beating the devil out of stuff, you freaking weirdo. Just kidding. Bob Ross is not a weirdo. There we are. He's a cool dude. Now then, I want to brighten that a little more. So I'll go right into titanium white. Go into the titanium put white. Too much brush. Go right up in here. Start I'm just gonna. Okay, he's putting titanium white right in the middle. I need to... I need to... I want this to be the lightest, brightest part of this whole painting. Okay. Right I'm stressed out. <laughs> and blending that outward. Oh! Gorgeous! To achieve a desired okay, now I'm gonna reduce the amount of paint again. Bright as you want. When it cuts to his animals out of nowhere, yeah, sometimes it'd be like, I brought a little squirrel today. It's so cute. It's supposed to be relaxing, but it's really not for me. <laughs> right now, I'm stressed out. I think, I guess you're supposed to maybe tape them, and then I don't know how you would work with this back in the day. Hi, listen, man. I never thought I'd be so stressed out. The sound viewed from hell through Apocalypse Clouds, what the heck? It looks just like his now. Look, I have a buckle here with me today in my hair. <laughs> Okay, so he's taking out the brush strokes. Mm, I'm just adding brush strokes. Uh. Okay, let's just do this. Finger painting! I don't have a finger brush! I can't use my finger bob. I'll use the, the detail brush. Hi, J. Credit, I'm mostly safe. Of course, then you have to clean your finger. You beat it against the easel the same. That's a bright sun. Right. Hi, Rosario. It doesn't look good. I don't know, man. I don't know. Okay, dry brush. We're gonna go in with the dry brush. Indication of the little sun will remain right there in the sky. That easy. What he's doing? Okay. okay. Let's have some fun. We're still using the same old brush, a little white. Okay. A little bit of that brown color that we made. A little white, a little bit of that brown color. Okay, I got it. Maybe in our world, we back in the What's distance. in our world, Bob? There's some little foothills that live back here. Foothills. Hi, Maxime. Oh, you like my hair? I keep forgetting that I have a goofy you hairstyle on. Where, they live in your world. where what lives? Foothills, foothills, right, right, right. Paint. Tell little stories. It makes painting easy. Uh, how am I gonna do this? I need the fit the fan brush, and I'm gonna change the thickness. Trapper that lived in the woods, maybe fell in the river. Just crazy things like that. But it gives you a reason for an old abandoned cat. Kind of like this. Like but make up little stories. Hi, Multicolor Boys. I'm on Asuka. Hello, you guys. Laugh at you standing around talking. To I mean, this is too... Okay. too much paint. Do less paint on my brush. I need thicker, too. There we go. Hello, Shadow! 
A little comforting voice? I'm too stressed for that. I'm too stressed. <laughs> And he's doing strokes up. I will catch up with this. I need to. Maybe I'll even take a little of the titanium. By the way, if you guys are painting along, you can feel free to use my art tag or post it in Discord or whatever when you're done. I want to see. Just here and there. Touch a uh, let's use the dry brush for this. And he, now he's doing highlights across the top. So. Just do that in a second. A little bit lighter. Like this. More paint. Less thick. A little white. A little more of that brown. Smaller. Oh god, that's too small. A little bit darker than what we have up there, but not a great deal. Maybe there's a little stand of trees in there right here. A stand of trees? What is this? Jojo? Just kidding, I don't know anything about Jojo to be able to make that joke. <laughs> I don't know. You decide. In your world, put trees I just know stands are a thing. He's doing trees already. I'm not nowhere near that step. I'm gonna try and catch up. And we come back with a little two-inch brush. Okay, so he's using the uh, wide bristle brush to make some trees. Easy. I think I can do the same thing if I kind of like go back and forth. Like Mine are coming too angled. It's too angled. Let me change to the... I'm gonna tap... Change to the tap brush. And change the angle to like be horizontal and then... Just do this. Hi, Absolute Link and Local Man. The trees are not happy yet. I mean, look at them. <laughs> Kinda works, see? And then he's kind of lifting the paint from the hills and I think I need more hill... Uh... More hill... In the painting. I'm just gonna cover all this up with that nice brown we made. There. Stop. Control-Z is not so cheating. Stop. It. Sort of a brown flavor to it. I don't have a... Uh, I don't have, uh, you know, paint thinner and stuff, so... Okay, so now he uses... I'll just use the dry brush. He pull, like, pulls the hills up into... Oh, that's wrong. Sometimes I have to use Control-Z, though, because the, the brushes don't behave as I expect. You know. I don't have the exact same brushes as him, so sometimes I gotta improvise. I'm gonna use my big wide bristle brush to do more of the hill. There we go. Just enough so it separates. Okay, what is he doing? I need to go back a <laughs> bit. Oh man. Okay, so he just dry brushed a bunch of trees. I'm just gonna, you know. Sorry, it's, it's really hard for me to chat. I, I didn't anticipate it was going to be quite this difficult. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. They have paint thinner and stuff. I don't have that stuff, so... It's a detail brush, too. A little bit. He's truly the master. That's all we're trying. Uh, dry brush. Okay, we're trying to show planes in the hill. So he's doing a little bit more white color. Oh, let's go back to white bristles. I care! Just kidding, I don't care where it goes. Let's go cover all this up with that nice brown we made. There. 
And then he covers a bunch of stuff up with the nice brown that he made. Sort of a brown flavor to it. Okay. Hello, Jeffrey. Color. And I like paintings that are almost monochromatic. Just one basic color. Alright. I'll tell you what. Sometimes. Okay, now he's taking his like brown color down and then crazy! Oh god, and Bob! <laughs> You're already so crazy. I can't see behind my phone, so I'm gonna have to move it a little. His is very like monochromatic on the bottom, so I'm gonna just mimic that. Just enough so that it separates. Okay, now he's using his palette knife. Just this. He's got... I have to go back again. Okay, it's a very, very pale, like... Orangey, paley color. But very, very pale. Hi, Comfort! And then he's taking the palette knife and he's kind of going... Ooh, it looks haunted. That's kind of fun. You just rub that I'm gonna put the amount of paint up because he's he's lovely. putting it on quite thick. And this is all done. It look like now watch it look like as a little, maybe a little river back here somewhere, but it's far away. We don't want a lot of detail in it. Far, far away. Just something like that. Far, far away. A river, far, far away. Would be a lot faster, and I think a lot easier to follow along if you're using actual paint, you know. Gonna get a little bit brighter, even. Digital makes it hard, it's really hard to follow along, but it's a fun challenge. Clean two inch brush, so I guess I should use this with no paint on it. Speed up if you don't use it. It's already slowed down, guys. Keep in mind. Okay, have a dark. I'm just gonna soften some of these a little bit. I'm making a happy little choice. Bravery test? Okay. of my brush is not, like, doing what I want it to do. He's able to keep his... I'll use the fan brush. He's able to keep his really, like, horizontal. But I'm really not. Because it's, like, going all around. So I'm gonna... He just makes a hill. He just makes a decision. He just goes... Bam. I don't like this, I don't like this, I don't like this. <laughs> I mean, it's literally a skill issue, but it is harder uh, with you could really put this in any way. I Clip Studio, to be honest. Practice this tapping, because we're going to put grass on top of this. And it gives you a chance to practice those strokes. And any time you can practice, it'll make your life so much easier. Yeah, he's like blending it out on the bottom and then adding like another. It should be more red. That's coming along pretty good there. Something about like Oh boy. Looking for is just a dark area. And we'll come back. Mine's not as like textured looking as his. Does a dual brush make it more textured? Sometimes it does. Oh, it like pushes it. Oh, it kind of does. Wow, look at that. Okay, that's good. That's what I want. That's what I want. That's what I want. That's what I want. 
Nothing else, you can be sure he would think whatever he managed to paint from following him is amazing. It's true, he'd probably be so... So impressed. <laughs> this is very slow, but I mean, it does look a lot more like what he's doing. Kind of have to tap like a madman. It looks like there's like a castle palace in the distance. You know what I mean? Yeah, it looks like it looks like a crazy distant planet. Turn the dual brush back off. Oh, he's putting grass on the top. Okay, I have to. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna just like fill this in, <laughs> and then I will add some texture uh, on top of it. Yeah, it looks like Mars. See how you can make all those little things. And now this shouldn't be, it's supposed to be a hill, so this should be like a... More smoother. Transition. Shouldn't be so jagged. It's hard to not make it jagged because... I cannot change the angle of this brush on a whim, but... Don't get crazy again. He likes to get crazy. Okay, so so I need to pause this for a second because I need to catch up this um this uh this tap brush with the dual brush, it's very, very slow to be able to use. I'm having it's not I'm not I'm not it's, I don't like it. I'm having such a hard time catching up. <laughs> He's popping off, eh? Oh, you know what he says now? We go into overdrive. I hope he doesn't say that. I start singing, oh, overdrive, oh, oh, overdrive. You know, uh. Going towards you, uh, Golden Slaughter. I don't think this is cheating, right? To to pause <laughs> to pause the video. I mean, who cares if it's cheating, right? I just want to get something that looks kind of what he, kind of like what he he does. I'm even gonna I'm even gonna super cheat and like kind of change up which brush I'm using and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a bad mamma jamma. Hello, um... Uh, Master Alucard. Super cheap. He knows exactly what to do and how to do, and he has all the experience. If you go at his speed, it'd be insane. Wouldn't that be crazy if I was just like a prodigy, prodigy somehow? Hi, Hyper Epsilon. Hello, hello. Oh, you can do it rapidly if you kind of do it up and down like this. Uh, uh, hello, Mo and Maggie Lun. It'd be fine if you didn't pause for one and try to follow along. I could try and do that for one of them. Yeah, I'll post that if you guys want to see. Um, and then he does like grass, green grass. I don't remember what color he uses though. Does art run in my family? Uh, my mom is like pretty good. She has like a pretty good natural skill of like painting and stuff. Grass. Okay. What color is Bob? Mine looks nothing like his. the station you're watching this on the call because they're available to us. Oh my god. If you'd like to see them, let them know. Love so stressing me out. Okay, whatever. It's gonna stay like this. Hi, Mia. I just want to be able to like fix the angle of this brush, you know? That makes things so much easier. We'll take some sap green. 
He's using sap green. Cad yellow. And cad yellow. Yeah. And yellow oh, ochre. Just tap. Now then. Oh, cad yellow. Yellow ochre. Okay, that's a good grass color. Uh, Something about my game. Just tap. It needs to be brighter, I think. Just tap. Oh god. You decide. I like it. This, maybe? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, just tap. And the more you tap it, the more it'll look it's not doing anything, boss! <laughs> Can I? Uh, I want to change it so that the brush angle is like. Uh. I want to change it so that the angle I can just control. Oh. Uh. If I use the detail... No, no, no. I'm gonna use the taps and fan again. I have no choice. Just have to make it smaller. Isn't that so bad? Okay, 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 okay. Now he's doing something with Van Dyke Brown. I don't know what he's doing. Even like smaller, like small, small, like this, so I can just go down. I like little trees. Without having to change the angle. Some of the nicest in the country. Do you say trees are some of the nicest people in the country? Those are not. I know he's making a tree. I can't catch up. And his is like a little better blended. No. I'm gonna blend. Blend mine a little bit. Less paint, more blending. I wish it was easier to apply texture with the, the dual brush because it's really, really difficult. Hey, Nelson! Shotting that much to be honest. I'm kind of just undoing a lot, which pr I probably shouldn't do, but at the same time, my brushes clearly do not work anything like his do. I'm just trying to get it look to look a little bit like his looks, you know? It's very, very tough. Eh? Yeah, I think this is getting better. I don't know. Okay, uh. Trees. He's doing trees. Eh? How do you do that, sir? Are there tablets that apply more paint the harder you press? Uh, it's not the. T I mean, most tablets are pressure sensitive, but it's just, it's a matter of. Uh, it's a matter of the settings of a particular program. Hi, Brianna. Brown. Blizzard crimson. Blizzard Crimson and Van Dyke Brown. Let's grab. I'm gonna use the number six fan brush this time. Number three would work for me. Doesn't matter. This is way darker, huh? Whichever one you happen to pick up, loaded full of color. Okay, now he is using the. So he's going down with it, like, totally vertical. He likes little trees. My person guy! He's going down like this. 
And then he starts really, really tiny at the top. <laughs> He said they're the nicest people, Bob. What does that mean? I'm just gonna kind of, you know. Hi, Revian. I remember when I was in some weird detention thing, we were doing some painting, so I chose to pick up Bob Ross' video despite having painted in a while. I was proud of the result. Yours also looks nice. Thank you. I'm struggling. I mean, I'm sure trees are nice, but they're not people, is the. Scratch it. Is that controversial? Hi, <laughs> Chaos Muffins. And then he kind of scratches away some of the paint. Okay, I'm gonna pause right here. I think I have the tree creating technique down mostly, although it's a little bit different than his. All trees used to be people. That's not true. What, what do you mean by that? Do you mean like from like a circle of life type of type of, <laughs> uh, viewpoint? Because if you think about it in that way, it's like, uh... You're not trees. Stop. <laughs> this is the weirdest grass lighting you guys have ever tried to do. Tell, try and tell me that trees are people. feel like you are a tree. Yeah, you are a tree. You are just a tree. Do you ever feel like you could be a tree? Sometimes I just feel like a tree. Do you ever feel already like a tree? Sometimes I just feel totally like a tree. <laughs> well, that went down too far. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> And then some of these should be longer, you know? Scraggly, like a tree. And then he does more of them. Don't know how he manages to do them in such close proximity of one another. Trees are very good listeners. They're good at keeping secrets, too. <laughs> I don't know why I said it in such a threatening way. I can hear my voice way too much. I hate it because my BDM is lower. Hello, James. <laughs> uh, let's do like this, I guess. I don't know. I think it's one more tree than he has, but I think it's fine. I like don't like how this looks, <laughs> but his looks great. It's not terrible to be honest, but uh oh, it kind of looks like they're all blowing one way with all the stuff on one side. It's honestly not like terrible. It's better than I expected. Yeah, I'm suffering. <laughs> uh. Just started drawing buckles all over your picture. We can hide some buckles. Buckles in this one. Bob Ross paintings always look good zoomed out. Yeah, he's he's cracked. Yeah, we can put a little buckle Easter egg. Okay, and then he does... Some white. I think he just uses the palette knife and like... Kind of scrapes away at the center. Hi, CJ! But I don't know if I can exactly do that. I'm gonna try. But if if I can't, I'm just gonna go in with the, the white. The titanium white and kind of carve it out that way. 
dum Like this. Depressed little, <laughs> just getting the happy cheese. Fight. That's how he always says it. He says titanium fight. <sighs> okay, now I'm gonna go back into this collar and just kind of break up some of that because I think that's too much white. So I'm just gonna break up some of that. All right. Brown color. Maybe All right, Bob. Bubble. Brown and bright red. And where are you putting that, sir? A little bit. I don't want a lot of highlights. Yeah, that's plain. Putting highlights on the tree branches, okay. So that you get the feeling there are some highlights, but they don't distract. Decide which tree lives in the foreground, which tree lives back. Oh, uh, I guess that tree lives in the back. That's a big tree, though. If that's the case. So we do him last. So he's just in front. Hope that shows up. Now yeah, we can go back to our brush that has the sap green, little Indian yellow. It's reminds me of a nightmare I had when I was a kid. I don't know if I ever told you guys about this. When I was a kid, I had a dream that... It was like... As I was in the woods... And I saw like pine trees with like red... Red pine uh, needles. Or they were like brown? I don't know. I guess they were probably dead. What are you doing? A house! I don't want to put a house! What the frick, Bob? We'll take a little Van Dyke, little dark sienna mixed together. And let's just paint this in. Yeah, do you guys live there? <laughs> Okay, I think I'm kind of getting the hang of this, uh, this, uh, fan brush. What the frick? <laughs> I don't know if I can handle a house, though. Yeah, I know, it looks like a castle in the back, right? It's kind of cool, though. We should go for a house like that. So far, it kind of looks like an outhouse. I'm supposed to do this with a freaking palette brush. Or a palette knife. I don't. Skirt. That's what he does. He goes like, scrape. Scrape. I don't understand perspective, Bob. Bob. Mr. Bob. A cabinectomy, he says. Better have a door in our cabin. Robert. I wish there was a quicker way to uh God. I wish there was a quicker way to change the angle. I know my house is not gonna be the perspective is not gonna make any sense. 
<sighs> I, I know, I love his little stories he tells. It makes it so cozy. Even though I'm not cozy. Don't be dissing my boy Bobby Ross. <laughs> when did I diss him? He's better than me, I just love him saying. <laughs> I need to make my house way taller. That's the house on the cliff. So that I can actually touch the ground. Like that. What is going on? <laughs> can I even salvage this house? <laughs> Why did I pick up the house? <laughs> Why is I? Why did I pick one that has a house? I didn't look this far ahead. Eh? <laughs> oh my god. You have a little squirrel. Say you do I want to see the squirrel! Uh, what did he do to make a to make a door? I'm just gonna do it, and then I'm gonna go in and make make everything texturally, you know, consistent after. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do next one. I'm just gonna do lots of pauses, and I'm gonna talk with you guys lots because this is not the cozy. This is not the cozy vision I had. <laughs> there. Gives us a nice roof. Gotta have a roof to keep uh. There we go. Oh, this squirrel is so cute. I want a pet squirrel. Something like that. Now, when you do yours, maybe you want to have a house that's different. Maybe you don't want to have a house. Maybe you want to have a two story house. Try one of Mario Paint. Oh, that sounds so stressful. Anything that you want to Squirrels are tree rats? Uh, are you saying rats are not cute? Because I would have to beg to differ. No pressure. Rats are freaking cute as frick. <laughs> Maybe there was a trapper who lived here and he went down to the river one day to check his beaver trap. I hope the trapper didn't live here. I don't like that idea. Okay, we got our little cabin. <clears throat> just like right on the edge of the hill. I'm gonna put more. There we go. Well, I can't do that, Bob. Better have a door in our cabin. A door? Okay. I can do whatever I want, Bob. <laughs> Uh, he's putting like a a red roof. Okay. It's not in too good a shape either. That's cute. That's cute. Yeah. But it's in bad shape. 
He has a little bit of white on his palette knife as well. I can't really do that, so I'm gonna have to add that in afterwards. Sun's really zinging across the top. I love how he describes stuff. And then... So it stands out. There. Okay, now we have to do the sun zinging across the side. Lovely. Right up here by the trees. Now he's finding more grass, which I will I can also do, but you saw some stuff, what do you see? Oh my god, he's gotta show this girl again, I'm gonna freaking die. Peapod! I thought he said Bob Jr. At first, but I said Peapod... Peapod Jr. Mm, I love it! I want one! He's raised a bunch of them. Isn't that sweet? I want to raise a squirrel. My cats would probably not be impressed, though. <laughs> Of course I enjoyed it. So cute. And I like to share it with my friends. Alright. Alright. Okay, I see a thing happening. Okay, now he does. He sees a thing. A thing happening. <laughs> oh, he's making like a little path. Oh, he's so talented. He's just doing like... It's all coming naturally. It just sort of happened. That's crazy. Watch here. We take a little brown, a little brown. What? No. Maybe. Uh, I want to change it so that this doesn't. Disappears, comes out here. I want to change it so that it doesn't turn due to the angle. I'm just whatever. I don't know. I want to fix it. <laughs> Stroke, maybe. No. He talks about his pet. He has a pet alligator. Oh. That sounds dangerous. I don't know which of these settings to go into to change the direction. So I guess I won't. <laughs> Brush tip. Oh, okay, okay. Thank you, thank you. Brush tip. Angle. Okay. None. Here we go. Okay, so here's a bunch of grass. So I'm just gonna pause the video and we're gonna leisurely do grass. And and hi guys. Not that sounded bad. We're gonna paint grass. It doesn't work though. <laughs> My brother bought a squirrel and wants to climb up in my back and spread fleas. Ew. Ew. Time to use a fan brush again. Taps and fans. Taps and fans. How long? Have you guys ever had fleas? Like, flea fleas? I've never had fleas. For the record. Hopefully that's obvious. But, uh... Well, I don't know. I guess you can get fleas from anything from, like, a dog or whatever. No, you're a human? I don't think it matters, right? I think you can get fleas regardless, can't you? <clears throat> Not personally. A tick once or twice? Oh, I had a tick on me when I was a baby. No, I think... I think humans can get it, right? I just wonder what the experience is like. <laughs> You got gotten fleas, Ma so far in preschool. What about lice? I've never gotten lice. I've never gotten fleas. Oh, the myth with head lice is that... I... Uh, you get them if your hair is dirty, but really... They like clean hair better, apparently. So 
the look of that treatment that went everywhere and irritated my lungs. Oh my god. Did a doctor treat that? That doesn't sound right. <laughs> The consp conspiracy theory meme that Fred Rogers and Bob Ross are war vets. I mean, it wouldn't surprise me. There was lots of lots of people were in the military, you know. <laughs> How do you hear a flea jumping around? Ooh, this looks cool. Wait, wait, wait. I'm on to something, you guys. Look at this. Yeah, there's been drafts and stuff, so, you know. It sounds like boing! What do you guys think? How's it looking? I'm really trying to, to make it look like his. And he did a little path. I forgot about that. I think I'm gonna try and edge my... Uh, just kind of edge it in, you know? Like, kind of... Just like... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Etch? Etch? Is that a convolution tool? I don't know what that is. Convolution? It's a revolution. Yeah, you guys like it. I'm gonna take the dual brush off this. We're gonna etch in a little path. And then now it looks like it's on top, so I'm gonna overlap that with more grass. So that looks more, you know, lived in and natural. Averages and nearby thing. Oh yeah, yeah, I think that's what it does in, in CSP. Hey Kenan and uh Ariane, how about you guys? I used to like the segment uh on his show where he would uh show paintings that people sent in. I thought that was sweet. Like pictures. <laughs> he says, I don't think it's big enough for a desktop wallpaper. It's only this big. You get thinking of Civilization for some reason. I think you should check that game out. Gandhi is a great guy. Civilization? Isn't that real-time strategy? I don't know, you guys. <laughs> oh, it's turn-based. Mm, yum, 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 yum. It is, and games of it can last ages. Oh my god. Can you play it by yourself? I thought it was like maybe a multiplayer thing. I don't know. It's a board game. Civ 1 on DOS is simple enough. I wouldn't be opposed to trying the DOS one. I think I would have to... Uh, like... Roll it in with some other games though. Why is nothing happening? <laughs> this single player too. Not a fan of RTS. Don't think it's much different. It's way different from Dota. Dota, my brain can handle. <laughs> I mean, RTS. I mean, it's just you know. Not that I don't like them necessarily. It's just I'm not great at them. Personal choice not to stream it, you know. I understand. Okay, so if you kind of like just pull this down quickly, you get some nice. Some nice strokes. Okay, now what is he doing? Okay, so he's doing like some grass, so I'm gonna try on. Uh... I'm gonna try using the detail brush for that. Very small. What his looks like, right? So he is doing a good job of doing them like behind the crest of the of the highlights. So that's probably what I should do. Okay, 
Let's get crazy. We got a minute left here. A minute? You're gonna get crazy in a minute. Van Dyke Brown mixed together. Black and Van Dyke Brown. Alright. Bravery test. God. Fuck! <laughs> A friend. I know he has no one do, okay? Deal with it. Let's go back to our liner brush. Deal with it. I'm gonna undo. I was hissing because he did. <laughs> Turn the bristles in there. That brings it to a very sharp point. Very sharp point? Okay. Happy little undo. <laughs> there is undo. Don't leave me alone. Yeah, if it's thin enough, it'll just flow right over the top. I need to make this way smaller. That's too small. If Bob had to undo, do you think he... I don't think he would. I think that's against the spirit. But I don't know. I can't... The thing is, I like can't undo years of art program conditioning, you know? <laughs> I've been control Z in from a very, you know, very young age. My whole family painting, on. Now I have my whole buckle family painting. Oh my god, you're done, Kayla! What the frick? Gave up <laughs> buckles everywhere. Never learned how to do digital art. I kind of like taught myself, but it's definitely tough. It's a big learning curve going from traditional. Oh. He's got branches going all over the place, so I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna do whatever. So he's doing highlights again. Okay. I could boost this. Yeah, we're pretty far along. These are pretty fast videos though. Tree bomb. He's a tiny baby tree. Shoot, we about gotta finish painting. <gasps> Paint thinner. Put a bit of the bright red. And let's sign this little rascal. Oh, I gotta sign it. Uh, in bright red. Okay. to see what you're doing. What do you think? So <laughs> I want to do some more grass. Thank you, Bob. I want to do some more grass. Hold on. 
like this. Right, right. Using this little detail brush. Yeah, you guys like it. Don't be discouraged, you guys, if you are not able to follow along. <laughs> uh, I also have a very difficult time. I ended up trotting a bunch, so... <laughs> You guys had a hard time, you know. It happens. Full disclosure, I did uh, practice once with this earlier on my other PC. So I kind of got used to some of the, the brushes and stuff, you know. Hmm. Alright, so... Yeah, let's put a little hidden buckle. Gotta make the buckle purple. He's gonna be peeking from behind the... Cosplaying as as Bob today. Okay. He got lost. Or maybe he's hiding from the hunter, you know? The trapper that lives in there. <laughs> it's kind of hard to see, but I guess that's kind of the point, right? Yeah, the hunter who is definitely not me and who is... I, I'm definitely not doing an ASMR like that later tonight also. <laughs> oh, I gotta stretch. Alright, uh... Let me... Oh my god, I forgot how ridiculous I look. <laughs> uh, let me save this and I'm gonna take a quick restroom break and then we can do one more, okay? The next one I'm gonna try and do it like real speed, you know. Um... Alright, I'll be right back, you guys be uh be that little squirrel while I was while I'm gone, okay? The little squirrel that Bob had his pocket. Hmm.
Tada ma mia oh hello panda hello 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 welcome welcome we're doing Bob Ross today okay so the next one uh thank you guys so much for waiting by the way and being a little peep paw while I was gone and thank you Turbo for the blue super chat while I was gone as well um so <laughs> yeah my hair is crazy today well it's not crazy it's just it's just different I think it's cute though I'm Bob Mia Ross Mia Bob Mia Ross Rania. <laughs> Um, um ba -dum -ba -da. You think I look cute? Thank you! You need a haircut? Why would I need a haircut? This is all of my hair. It's just up into a, a... You know... A fluff. Yeah, I wash my hands. Okay, so the next one I'm gonna do is... I had a mountain one. Hold on. Oh, uh... I don't know what mouth to learn. I got my part of my mouth. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I have my I have my tablet pen in my mouth. So this one is season five, episode one. And he paints a like a mountain. So I wanted to try one of the mountain ones because <laughs> too lame with words. Well said thank you, thank you. Uh I didn't chew on it. I just needed it in my uh mouth so I could use both of my hands. And I didn't want to put it down. Because if if I put it down I put it down on my tablet accidentally and then yeah yeah yeah. Hi Sa Is this one famous? I just really wanted to try a mountain because... Uh... The last one was a mountain one too with the house. No, this is not a mountain. This is just hills. This one's like an actual mountain where he uses like the palette brush to like... Uh, to like carve out the highlights and stuff. <laughs> there were a thousand things that didn't want to put in your mouth. It's just... Listen, okay? I wanted to put it in my mouth then. What? What about it? <laughs> Do mountains remind me of anything? Uh... Um... No? Should they? <laughs> I want it in my mouth, okay? Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Uh... Alright. So let's get rid of this. I already saved it, don't worry. And then I'm gonna fill this one in with white as well. Titanium white. And then. Alright. I'm gonna make my color mixing thing a little bit bigger. Okay, we're gonna put this at proper speed, okay? Uh, just the normal speed, and I'm gonna follow along as normal, as best as I can. Oh god, don't play the song. That could be bad. That could be bad. <laughs> okay, here we go. Two and a half inch? Okay. Oh, that's too big. <laughs> what is that? A lizard in crimson? That looks freaking purple and blue. My lizard in crimson looks red, Bob. Wait, why is it blue? Oh no, that's not the... Okay, I need to go back because I don't know what paint... What color he used. Is it Prussian blue? Prussian blue, maybe. Uh. No dual brush, okay. That's easy. God, it's already not going well. <laughs> very, very little color when you first start. You know, very, very little color, okay. Now, while, while I've got this old dirty brush going here, I'm going to reach right up into this. See, Rocketo Cato! And we want a very, very small amount. Don't say it's ruined, okay? Don't be rude. Just mix it right on the brush. There we go. We're going to get there. We're going to get there. Water. Okay, he's using yellow blue. Okay, 
Are you not familiar with the bomb rass memes? Oh, no, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry for thinking you were being rude. I didn't know. I didn't know the meme. Now I'll wash the brush. I saved it. I saved it. I never, never wash my brushes with turpentine. I don't know. So give me one to look up. Give me a Bob Ross meme to look up later. Sorry for assuming. Yeah, you like my afro? Hi, Shifter House and Sultan. Now with a clean dry brush, we'll go back into this guy. Clean! And just very quickly blend it out a little bit. Those light spots remain. If Bob Ross does something that looks a little weird, everyone else will ruin it until he makes it. He's on Twitch? What the heck? An almighty fan brush. I'm using a number six fan brush. Okay, number six fan brush. Titanium white. With a little bit of the lizard and crimson. Very, very little. A lot of paint, he says. Wait, what's happening? There's nothing happening. Oh god! Why not? Oh, I have the dual brush on. Okay. That's too dark. That's too dark. Uh... That's too much paint. Uh, just a mountain and waterfall, it says. So let's start right here. Very lightly. Very lightly. Very lightly. Very lightly. Here's some air. Generally slightly caress the canvas. Very, very, very touching. Blend the bottom out. Leave the top of the cloud alone. Let's do this one. And work in layers. Okay, now. Let's fluff this cloud. Okay, he's fluffing the cloud. I'll take the amount of paint down to nothing. Oh yeah, Bomb Ross sadly passed away uh, ages and ages ago. nice legacy of teaching people who probably didn't think they would be able to paint or do any kind of art. Uh, uh, giving them, you know, the confidence to, to, to try and paint and stuff, which is really something I really appreciate, you know. Okay, mountains. Okay, so far we're following along okay at the actual speed. Palette knife, yellow blue. Yeah. That's Prussian blue. There's a little bit of a lizard crimson, so we have Van Dyke Brown. Van Dyke Brown. And a small amount of a lizard crimson. Lizard crimson. And the more crimson you put in, the more purplish your mountain's gonna be. Pull this paint out very flat and just cut across it so you have a small roll of paint. There, right out on the edge of the knife. Okay. Go up here. Now you have to make you have to make some decisions. What angle, Bob?
side there's a bump or a hill or a big stone. The afro was a nice touch, thank you, thank you. I wanted to do a paint palette as well, but I ran out of time, sadly. Yeah, I'll do that in a minute. Scrape off some of the excess. The devil have electronic. To I put it in my mouth. <laughs> I put the pen in my mouth. <laughs> I didn't chew on it or anything, but. Okay, now he's doing some blending, so I'm gonna do the same. Okay, he's moved on to snow already. Hold on, hold on, Bob. No pressure. Chill. No pressure. No pressure. Bob, chill. Okay, wait. <laughs> First of all, it's not an island. Maybe it's a volcano, though. Pumpy. He said phthalo blue and Van Dyke brown. Okay. A secret fortress island? Oh. It's like in uh, uh, Austin Powers. <laughs> oh, he's getting excited. Bob's getting excited. A bit dark. Yeah, it's some white. This offers you unlimited freedom. Unlimited freedom. And that's what we're all looking for. Too true. Now, let's just sort of bring these together. He's going sickle mode. I don't know if I'm doing this right, but looks nice anyway. Oh yeah, is my hair comfy? Buckles who are in my hair. <laughs> my mountains look nothing like his mountains. <laughs> I don't know if I can do it, Bob. Now we'll take the large brush. I want to create some mist down here. So here He's creating mist. Okay. There's no cracker comes in my head. I've been hard to breathe though. There's no chemicals either. What the heck? <laughs> it smells nice, tastes nice too. Can't eat it though. Illegal. Let's play a game. Let's play a little bit here. 
maybe one of these peaks let's, here. Let's play. Show you how to, to bring a mountain. Well, let's, I tell you what. I see the island. Such a good time here. Show you something else too while I'm here. We'll take a little of the magic white and add it right into my titanium. What's magic? I don't have magic white. I don't know what that is. One of our golden rules, thin paint. We'll stick to a thin I think I blurred it. I think I, I ruined it. <laughs> Yeah, he's using a fan brush to do clouds in the back now. Barely touch it. This is a thinner paint. And it'll stick on top of that thick paint that's already up there. Okay, maybe he's got a little frame that lives right here. Oh, is it primer? Maybe it was a happy little <laughs> He sort of, maybe he fell out of the sky and he just floating right down here at the bottom of this mountain. And oh, he's doing it in front of the mountains. Okay, okay, okay. So I'll just use less paint if it's paint thinner that he's doing. It's time to do 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 It does look like a nice... Ooh, it looks like a nice, uh... Spa, you know? I don't know why spa. I guess because of all the mist. <laughs> See how that shadow makes it just pop out. That's, that's what now he's at the stage where I have no idea what you're doing, Bob. I like to spend the whole thing working on mountains. Mountains do not really look like mountains. Okay. Tell you what, I'm gonna mix up. We just use the same mountain color and we'll put some sap green into it. So we have blue, brown, little lizard, and crimson. Lizard. And a touch of sap and green into it. Blue, brown, sap green, lizard, crimson. Just a little bit. Okay. And we'll clean them in there. We'll use the fan brush and I just quickly lay a little on here. Now I want to have maybe like a little tree line going up the side of this mountain. So I'm okay, he's doing a tree line. And you still, still need to follow the angles in that mountain. Always follow the angles in that mountain. Isn't that easy? That I'm still mixing my color. Forest area. He's climbing right the side. Okay, he's using the fan brush to do... are too far in front of the mountain, I think. Well, my grass isn't very green. Now this softens and brings everything together. That easy. Greener. Aw, he's so sweet. I can put more clouds on top of it after he's supposed to. No. Cover it up because I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to be overlapping this grass with the clouds. He's doing happy little trees. I will 
just like poop. <laughs> literally, literally. <laughs> Happy little, happy little logs. God, my freaking thing is, uh... Happy little logs. <laughs> my freaking thing is, uh, lagging. Oh god, I did a big strong- No! Behind, I gotta catch up to Bob. And when you mix on the brush, you get all these different layers. You don't have oh my god. Dead color. And we're looking for a bright, shiny color. Okay, now we touch and push, bend up. Do so you want a raisin? You stay. No, I wanted pines. I'm trying to do what Bob's doing. It's so hard. And then he puts some like in, in front. Eh? Oh God! Oh God! It's fine. 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 Doing reflections. Okay, I can I can salvage it. I can salvage it. Stones. Oh my God, you're way ahead of me, Bob. We're suffering. I'm struggling. Okay, so this is the stones. Oh no, I forgot to do the reflections. Oopsie. Don't fight it! Don't fight what? I'm not trying to! Okay, and then he's going in with white. It's not a mistake, it's a happy accident. Okay. It drops 
It's right in here. Put some water right in here. I can do that. Wow, that's beautiful! That's gorgeous! Okay, it just came into existence! What the frick? Reflections I mentioned. Oh my god, it's so depressing, Bob. <laughs> He's right, though. Okay, I'm gonna do the tree he does, but what I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna do a little bit of Misty Mist to, uh, To, uh, at the bottom here. Like it's a real deal waterfall. Okay, huh? Okay, he just does like a bunch of stuff and then. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god. Indian yellow. Yellow ochre and some permanent red. I want one that shines right here. Just like so. I don't know what he's doing and how he achieved it. I'm just gonna do this. Do you enjoy this? Just do just so just do this. Draw the rest of the owl. And we'll teach you some of the most fantastic. He's making bushes. There's not really a brush in it that is like highly textured like 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 his. Okay, now, you know. Guess this is kind of. And I think we have a finished painting. And with that, he says he's finished. Here. God, the outro music is playing! I'm not done! This should be more defined because it's in the... In the foreground, so I'm just gonna put this. <laughs> no, the music! Play. No, don't play something. No! Okay. Let me try and finish mine. Uh. Uh, taps and fan, dual brush. Lots of paint. There we go. There is my favorite little brush. Phew. Tapa tapa tapa. You just tapa 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 away. Tapa away your stress. 
<laughs> tap a tap of the sorrow away. Tap. Oh God. Oh wait, that's actually. Oh. <gasps> Look at this. Oh my God. Let's paint, let's paint! Yeah, I know I haven't been able to beat the devil out of my brush. I'm cooking. It's still too much paint. Oh my god. Hey, okay, this is something. <laughs> Lighter at the front, right? That's what he teaches. <laughs> and then a big tree! It's so hard. There must be some beginner ones, right? I feel like it feels impossible. <laughs> there must be some beginner tutorials. Like, this is season 20 something. I don't know. It's this very late season. Okay, I'm gonna use my detail brush to do this. That was season 5, so maybe if you start with season 1. So I think he does like a pine tree, right? Okay, let's do this too. Oh, don't get frustrated. It's supposed to be joyous. You gotta pause. <laughs> you gotta tape it. You gotta tape it and then come back later. Yeah, I've seen some of the episodes with this sun. As well. A couple of episodes we use a limited palette and simple scenery. Yeah, maybe it's good to start with some early on, you know. Okay. Uh I think if you really take your time, you're gonna have a better time. It's just the the fact that you have to like Follow along so quickly. Maybe you should have started on episode one? Well, I just wanted to start with something that... You know, I like the look of. Uh, oh, he does pine trees. Okay, wait, hold on. You can do that as well. Imagine Bob Ross doing Zen riddles. What is the sound of one hand clapping? This tree was closer to the margin. Yours might cover the far shore too much. It's fine. It's, we gotta make decisions. We gotta make decisions. Eh? There are no mistakes. No mistakes. Eh? It's not always... Well, sometimes he does bare pine trees is my, is my point. <laughs> Why are you blushing? What did I say? Okay, I know what I can do. Look at this. <gasps> Look at this! Okay, so this is gonna be epic. Stop, you guys are scaring me. <laughs> Making me think I said something weird. I have a not so wholesome. <laughs> oh god. When are you not saying weird things? Usually, I'm usually not saying weird things. Come on. What do you mean? I'm innocent, I tells ya. Here we go. Now this is working out. Oh, 
Although it's doing some weird stuff on the... Down here. No, I'm not gonna do a pull. Okay, I don't need to do a pull. <laughs> I already know. Last time I did a pull, you guys... You guys... You guys meowed it up. <laughs> Yeah, these look like pine trees, right? I like the way these trees look. Always do with crayons, paint, but never tried software. It's fun, you should try. There's lots of free software you can use, like Krita and... Uh, Gimp, you know. You like my trees. Buckles cannot be trusted not to be a mobile pole. <laughs> yeah. Okay, uh... Let's do a little bit of highlight. Oh, is Gimp no good for art? So the first one in Krita Shrine, the second one in Ace by Wool. Not voting for what you want equals messing up. Yeah, you got it. Yeah. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> uh, okay, palette knife. Let's go. First part of trying digital art for me is learning the tools available. Mm -hmm. There's a lot. Don't scare me, there's a lot of blood. It's not blood, it's just, you know, iron enriched uh, soil. Okay, huh, and then... Okay, now let's put some more grass and then I'm gonna be... I'm gonna be done. My name. Uh, wait, I wanna. I wanna fix this waterfall a little bit because I feel like it should be more textured. Okay. Uh. Bad. Saved it. <laughs> uh. This looks like a child road. <laughs> Yes. Hi, Stag. Thank you for the five months to save. <laughs> I saved it. Okay, let's let's actually save it, and then you guys can see. Yeah, but you guys put it on your fridge on the wall. They I'm gonna sleep with blue paint all over. Wait, on my lips. <laughs> no hidden buckle. I'll put a hidden buckle where you guys can't see it, and then you'll have to try and figure out where I put the buckle. How's that sound? 
Uh, right here. Obvious where it is, <laughs> but <laughs> ruined. No, just kidding. I. Uh... Two. All right. Are you guys ready to see what we painted? Oh, I called the first one Bob Ami 1, and then I called the second one Ami Ross 2. <laughs> Why are you so bad at it? <laughs> do you ever do landscape art? No. Where'd it go? Here we go. <laughs> I don't do landscape art at all, actually, except for like in, you know, A Sprite sometimes. Well, what do we think? I know the lips are so freaking uh <laughs> so freaking obvious. I to be honest, I have no idea how I followed along with the mountain one. At at, at the actual speed. Learning how the tools worked a little bit helps, you know. Having having the experience in the first one. Okay, well that's basically all I have planned for this stream in terms of you know doing art. So <clears throat> it's supposed to be you know shorter today. I still have to 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 uh, set up for Azimar, which I'm very nervous about. Hi, Orange Crash. I'm here with an afro. It's something I didn't realize I needed. <laughs> I want I want an excuse to bust it out some other time. You know. Uh, yeah, I'm very nervous because I just don't want to be. As long as you guys don't find, don't think I'm cringe, then I'll be fine. You know, I'm worried that you guys are gonna think it's cringe. <laughs> but basically, it's like a continuation from the uh, the um uh, spider, the spider, Azimer. That I did last time. I was watching your odd world, wondering when the next episode is. Uh, it will be Monday. I will be playing that again. Once a week. Uh. Am I ever cringe? Literally every day. And you guys liked the last one, so yeah, this is this one's just more of me being like a creepy, you know. Creepy spider girl, stalker girl, who's gonna eat ya? <laughs> it's just like that, you know? Be cringe and free. Well, I'm cringe! I don't know if I'm free, though. I don't know, it's like, uh... It's like, uh... It's difficult. <laughs> <laughs> it's difficult. Set me free, set me free. Well, if you guys liked it, and if you guys liked the other... I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'll, I'll be fine, I'll be fine. Just gotta let me know. Uh, it's later today, it's in like a... Um, let me check the waiting room. Uh, uh, uh. Oh god, stop. For some reason, when I click on my YouTube bookmark that's in my hot... Tab bookmarks or whatever. It's to uh it brings me to like a commercial. <laughs> a commercial for the Activision hockey from the commercial watch along way back when. An hour forty minutes, oh god, that's not a lot of time. <sighs> okay. <laughs> okay. Well I'll get going then so I can so I can get ready and set up for that. Is that okay you guys? That will be soon. Soon, soon, soon. Um that one's gonna be on the shorter side as well. Two shorter streams today, but you know, by the end of it all. 
I should, by the end of it all, it was Cutmaster Kurt with the remix one thing. I don't know why. <laughs> uh, my heart's already beating, 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 beating. Yeah, I can give you guys a hug, of course. Yeah. You want to sleep soon, Ria? Thank you for coming. Um. Yeah, I have to mentally prepare myself. Okay, so I'm gonna head off. Uh, for now. <sighs> um, but I will see you guys in a bit. Just a short little fun little roleplay little Azimer stream. Right. Okay. Okay. Uh, thank you guys for coming to this fun. It was a very hectic art stream. Uh, maybe we can try another one some other time where I kind of take longer on one painting. We can do more Bob Ross stuff. At some point, maybe. I mean, it was, it was fun. It was fun. It was a fun challenge. To get it to look like anything, you know. Um, I'll see you guys in a bit. Thank you so much for coming today. Thank you to all my regulars and irregulars. And everyone who uh, stopped by for the first time. Appreciate you giving me a chance. Thank you so so much to all of the VOD watchers and VOD commenters and chatters and lurkers. And thank you very much to all of my dream weavers, buckles, spiderlings, and everyone who uh I um um uh donated and renewed their memberships to this stream. I appreciate you guys. I will see you in a little bit for some Azimer. I hope that's more relaxing than this one. <laughs> okay. Thank you, thank you. Otsukai-san, Mia. Oyasu, Mia. Bye-bye.